And welcome back, this is Beller Scuba with another StarCraft 2 commentary. I am the Blue Terran in the um, East Northeast, uh, East Northeast, up against Terramorius, uh, the Red uh, Terran in the North Northeast. You know, I'm just going to call this North and this East. Uh, save me some time. This is a uh, scrap station. Uh, this is a relatively new map for me. I do enjoy it because um, the rocks uh, prevent a lot of rushes early on. Uh, there's actually two sets of rocks between the two. Uh, they do have quick um, air distance, as you can see. Uh, drops right here to here don't take that much. Look, there's even a cable between the two. Uh, there's a great expansion here that uh, most people forget about because it is between the two uh, bases. Uh, he's a little slow on that supply depot, as opposed to me. I do get, uh, by the time he's... Oh, but he does get the barracks right away as well. Does he supply lock himself? Yes, he does. He can't, uh, even though he's not building any SCVs, it wouldn't help anyways. Oh, now it would. That supply depot is up. And he's going for two barracks, so it does look like he's going for a rush early on. At least that's what it looks like. But uh, no um, gas yet. No SCV production. Uh, I've already taken a commanding lead in the SCV count. Uh, 15 to 11. And an engineering bay. I have changed this um, build quite a bit. I don't get that second engineer, uh, that first engineering bay until I get two or three barracks out. It seems to work a lot better to prevent rushes. Um, as you guys probably saw in my last game, I did lose to another zergling rush. That happens to me quite a bit. Usually, if the game goes long, I do end up uh, winning the game. But if it's a short game, uh, they come out with rushes, uh, be it marines, um, be it uh, zerglings or uh, zealots. I typically can't handle it early on. Uh, because, and it might be because I get the engineering bay early. It might be because I get that tech lab right away instead of getting a, at least a first marine. Um, but knowing that I was against the Terran, I don't block off here. This is a bad uh, map to block off with. As you can see, it requires... Uh, two supply depots and two barracks to block off uh, this large ramp and scrap station. He is going for bunkers early. Maybe he's just scared of a rush. He's not actually going to be going for a rush himself. Oh, but he's got oh so much Q here. That's 200 minerals that could be used somewhere else along with another uh, 50 here. So 250 minerals could be used uh, somewhere else, but he's not using the rest that he has now anyways. Uh, 200, I've got uh, under 100 minerals. Um, very active in the early game. <laughs> not doing very well in the APM. Uh, remember, we are on bronze ladder. You will not be seeing too high of uh, APM in the bronze ladder. If you can get 50, you will smoke the competition here regularly. I'm, I'm not talking... Um, you know, at any given point, uh, I've seen it go up to 150, but uh, average of 50 will do very well. But it's still early on the game. Uh, not that much to be doing, really, if you keep doing this, as a lot of people do. Uh, this, will, uh, As far as I can see, it adds to your APM, but it does nothing to help you. I'm sorry. I, I laugh every time I see it. I'm just now getting my second barracks. I did go for the bunker to try to block off. I think that is a full block off there. So uh, I think I'm a little better off at the block off. That tech lab, which would be the weak spot in the block off, is kind of hard to get to um, because it's further back than everything else. So I think my um, block off is a little better than his. Two supply depots, but he does reinforce those with bunkers. And he did... No? It looks like he upgraded his bunker, but... No, he did not do that. I've already forgotten what the upgrade one looks like because it's been so long since I've actually seen them. Uh, don't get the, the upgrade bunker. Um, it's really just for early game, and you don't and you don't want to waste any minerals or any gas, especially gas in the early game. So uh, still have a lead in the harvester count. 
uh, I do have mules out, so um, that number is high um, in the minerals. He does have an orbital command and as well as a mule, so uh, the difference right now is in the minerals as we both just have two gas fully saturated. I do have the factory with the tech lab going down. Uh, will we be seeing uh, some Thor play in this game? I don't know. I think usually I just go for the siege tanks uh, for defense. But on this map, uh, siege tanks aren't that great um, unless they do a drop. You know, there's so much room for drops back here. Here, uh, That's why I put a starport here um, in case uh, they go for the drop I can get try to get some quick vikings out to counter but so much room behind the base uh, that's so this is great for air um, both of us are going uh, looks like for infantry right now though but we both have a factory and a starport up um, his, his up is up just before mine um, Wow, look at all I'm producing. He's just getting two Marauders. He is getting Concussive Shells. Just started that. I did finish that. And um, meanwhile, getting a Marauder Siege Tank. So that factory will be used for a Siege Tank. Am I getting the Siege? Yes. Almost done with the Siege Tech. Um, Going to keep it here just in case he does uh, plan to go with a Timing Attack, I'm told it's t called. Not a Rush. Uh, because it is almost 10 minutes into the game. Still no attacks yet. Uh, this is, like I said, Bronze Ladder. Don't expect early uh, attacks except for rushes. Rushes come in about five minutes. If uh, there's no attack then, uh, maybe seven minutes, nine, ten minutes is pretty late. And then really you're looking at uh, the 12 minute mark as the next po point you'll be attacked. I am getting the armory up. I believe that's just for um, the weapons upgrades. I don't believe I upgrade anything in this uh, armory. I uh, hope I'm not spoiling too much. <laughs> but uh, this is pretty standard for me. You guys should be expecting it from me. Um, because it does uh, pretty well. As far as I can tell. And continuing just... Uh, Go for the MMM build. There's a uh, Medivax. I'm not currently getting any more uh, Marines or Marauders. Um, where is that SCV building supply depot? There he is. You need to work faster. I wish I had Chrono Boost. <laughs> um, but unfortunately, I doubt that would work as the SCV uh, can't be pro. I'm sure his cr drill can't be Chrono Boosted. That joke failed miserably. I will not make it again. So I move out with the, the army. Um, once again, standard play for me. Uh, just trying to secure the expansion. Make sure nobody, nothing's down there. Just a quick check. And then there goes the SCV to build uh, the, the expansion, the second command center. This is pretty, I would consider this unnatural. It's pretty well guarded. Um, you know, there's room for drops up here. And then uh, the... Marines can go down, and uh, Marines, Marauders, whatever, what have you. Uh, this would actually be great for siege tanks. Um, I believe um, a siege tank here uh, can take out quite a, a few uh, SCVs. Uh, at least these three patches might be able to reach the command center. Don't quote me on that, though. I haven't tried it. Uh, broken medevac down here. Not sure if that's going to be used in this game. I highly doubt it. And finally, Tech Lab's up on those initial two barracks, so he is going heavy into the Marauders. Uh, looks like 13. Oh no, that's mine. He's got uh, 10 Marines, 6 Marauders, and of course, most of those Marines are in the bunkers. So he's really only got 2 Marines out and 6 Marauders. Lots of SCVs just hanging out though. Uh, I probably shouldn't criticize him. I bet if we go back to my base, there will be some there, too. No, I'm actually doing pretty good. And I do have one missile turret. I really should be backing that up. Get missile turrets maybe here, 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 here. Uh, because um, they, he could be coming in with banshees, which always seem to give me trouble. And yes, this, speak of the devil. 
and banshees are devils. Uh, he, he not only is he getting banshees, he's getting cloak, um, so he can uh, come in as long as he avoids that one missile turret. He can go around, start harassing anything in sight, uh, because I have no energy on my orbital commands. Um, just trying to get uh, more minerals at this point in the game, trying to build up. What am I trying to build up? Marines, um, Marauders, and I am getting a Thor. So, um, <laughs> we are seeing something else out of the factory. I always feel like I neglect the factory too much, so I am getting a Thor. Because air is so good on this map, I figure I will need Thors uh, to counter anything that he sends my way in terms of air. Ooh, a hundred... Oh, there we go. I was say, uh, he had, uh, looks like 150 energy on that orbital command, queuing up large amounts of uh, SCVs, and uh, looks like that was all he had queued up, though, so uh, not as bad as I thought. It doesn't look like he's producing much else, just a siege tank and more banshees. He is now getting stim pack. I get it a lot earlier in the game, uh, maybe even than I should. But it's just so effective. Um, even if you can't get medevacs early, you know, it does uh, boost everybody's stats by 50% uh, at the cost of just 10 health. Um, and remember that Marauders actually have 125 health, so they'll still have 115 health after a stim. And th that gives them a 50% boost uh, for 15 seconds. So I think it's uh, something that not a lot of people utilize that early in the game uh, at lower levels. It is something that I uh, focus on. I, I really do try to remember to get the stim pack as early as I can. These two SCVs still just hanging out, and he's still supply locked. Uh, so that is the reason he had two SCVs going on uh, supply depots. Um, now he's just down to one and two SCVs just kind of hanging out. As my army continues to get builder, I'm bigger. I'm just going to keep these Thors in the base. Um, I, not, I have never tried to medevac a Thor drop. Uh, that would probably have done fantastic in this game. Um, although that, ooh, that, that, that 50 damage on the Thor might have killed it. Never mind. I, good part. Oh, 400 health. Uh, give and take, um, probably better just to keep him here because I only have two. Uh, but I do have quite a bit of um, of an army here, and I'm going to 